huge round of applause and a warm heart. Please welcome Mr. Ajay Devgan. I'm sure we can make a little more noise. All right, so meanwhile, they are, is it ready? Yeah? Okay, so we'll see the video first. So get ready to take off, you guys. I would say a huge round of applause for Captain Vikrant Khanna, right? So, all right, since you both are here with us and everybody is also here, so we'll be starting with the questions. My first question would be to Neeraj. Uh, metaverse is a question that everybody needs an answer to. You know, so tell us what is metaverse and will it be the next big thing in the coming years? Sure, before that, another round of big, big applause for the fabulous uh, trailer that we got to see. And thank you once again, all of you, uh, for being here. I will try to explain it simply, but for starters, this uh, term is metaverse. To put it very simply, it is, it's like discussing what the internet was in the early 90s, at some level. How this entire piece will get built out over the next 10, 20 years is really going to be up to the imagination of the ecosystem. But in a very simple way, jo hum, jo hum karte hain in the physical world, those are experiences which we can now start experiencing in what is called as the virtual world or the metaverse. And the first reflection of this is by way of creating avatars of ourselves. Aaj, whether it's a phone, you know, you send a message, aapko kuch emoji banate ho, an emoji banate ho. These are what I will call as the early building blocks. These avatars are going to be something that you will empower as a consumer. A term hai along with metaverse which is called Web3, Web3.0. Now, again to simplify it, in Web2.0, which was the social media world, where we create communities, but the principal uh, audience was happening on a specific platform. Wo platform may there have been issues pertaining to privacy, etc. But that community is owned by that platform. So if it is Ajay's fans who are following on various uh, networks, he's communicating with them one-on-one. -on -one. Web3 is going to bring more and more empowerment to the consumer. So we, jo fans engage kar rahe hai, they now have, uh, it, is, it, is, it is the uh, empowerment of them, plus it is up to them what kind of insights, information they want to unleash. So, simply put, metaverse may think of it as three elements. First is virtualization of yourself. The second is there will be virtual experiences. If you are shopping, you can create a shopping environment. If you sit and chat, you can have your virtual avatars talking with each other. Uh, and again, not to take too much time, but again to simplify it. It's like right now we are, two of us are here. In, in physical sense. There could be digital Ajay 1, digital Ajay 2, digital Ajay 3. And five years from now, he could empower that those three avatars are having social interactions, they are having commercial discussions. Oh, Kumar Ji ke saath kuch aur discuss kar rahe hai. Digital Kumar Ji ke saath ek project discuss kar rahe hai. And when he comes back in the evening, he's able to see, okay, uh, they will learn from your own ex in real world interactions. And so productivity that happens of humanity technically can increase infinitely. But it's up to you. Aap kitna karna chahte is cheez pe. So not getting very geeky, simple things. Or ismay, gaming is going to be one of the key elements. Joki, we are also trying to take that forward. Yeah. All right, thank you so much. So it's like basically clones, multiple clones of yourself being everyone. Similar. Clones is a, is, a, is a nebulous, not clones really. Yeah, yeah. obviously. I mean, yeah. to put it in a very layman's yeah. term is what probably yeah. I could think yeah. of. But thank you so much. Can we have a huge round of applause for him? Yeah. So Ajay, my next question would be to you. Your upcoming movie, Runway 34, is collaborating with Hefty Verse. And Web 3.0 is an initiative by Hangama. So tell us about the collaboration. I like Neeraj explained uh, what uh, metaverse and everything is simply. Uh, 
I wanted to join them because ek to, uh, you can reach out to more people and I wanted to reach out to the maximum people and I think the best option I had was him and his company. So that's why uh, I joined them. Well, so great to, I'm sure everybody is great to have you on board and we are loving this particular collaboration. But I must, I must say something here. So, of course, uh, it's an honor and a privilege uh, to, to uh, collaborate uh, with uh, Ajay Devgan Films, with Ajay Kumarji and everybody. And they've known each other now for, we've known for two decades. Lekin, ek cheez mein bataunga, inke saath, it has been always about trying to simplify things. So, the aspect ki hum ye game karenge, this was a thought that came from him, said, what is unique in this? And the interesting part is when you look at uh, how we build it out, you know, when it comes to things linked to aviation, etc., there is always an aspect of simulation. So, hopefully that's something which we'll share as well. Well, I think since you're talking about it and right now for which we are all present here, so let's do one thing, let's, uh, you know, come to the part where we are going to launch the Runway 34 game. So, I think we'll have a first look at it. This is the right moment since you have spoken about it, what Metaverse is and how the collaboration has been. So, we'll have a first look at the Runway 34 game. Or it's an amazing game and we definitely can't wait to fly with Captain Vikrant. Let me rather put it that way. I hope you guys liked it. Can we have a huge round of applause for the game launch? Thank you. Thank you so much. Well, since we have uh, revealed the first look of the game, my question for you both is that, you know, you both have been the giants of the Web 2.0 community and now you're, you know, getting into the Web 3.0. How and when did this idea come to you all and was it like easy or difficult to adapt it? So, yes, I, I think Web 3 is something that we had been looking at now for almost about 18 months. And uh, I'm delighted that we found uh, a fabulous partner in the form of Polygon uh, in doing this. And Polygon kind of started with the core, uh, you know, sort of understanding with regard to the foundation on the back of which what needs to be done. Hangama is also uh, privileged to have Intel as an investor. Intel has been an investor into Hangama now for 10 years. Intel has been at the forefront of some of the most amazing digital innovation uh, whether it's to do with uh, its technologies linked to uh, actually sort of streaming or it is to do with gaming and virtual reality, etc. So I think, you know, various partners got together and Hangama has taken pride in the fact that, you know, in the last 20 years, if one thing we have done for the industries, we've always been a couple of years ahead. We have used this way to demystify the medium to all our stakeholders whether it is uh, the uh, artist fraternity, the studios, the record labels. Uh, and we've paved the way in such a way that everyone wins, uh, whether it's to do with the industry, the consumers. Uh, and today, Web3 is getting to a stage where uh, you can actually have what you call as fractional ownership. You know, you can, you can not just be a fan, you can feel that you have a stake and ownership in things. So this is... This is a step in that direction. And I couldn't have been happier to have, uh, uh, you know, one of the sort of most successful uh, film stars of uh, Hindi and Indian cinema uh, to be partnering with us. He also happens to be one of the most elusive stars. So it makes me bringing him onto this stage even more special. And I mean it, Ajay, with all, all respect. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Would you like to add something to that? No, like uh, everybody is still trying to understand uh, what uh, Web3 was. Uh, I was also doing the same thing till Neeraj explained to me how it works and I love technology and I feel that uh, we uh, always have to look ahead, not behind, otherwise we'll be left behind. So this is something just as the beginning and uh, it might look very small today but it's going to go, uh, it's going to replace everything like everybody thought uh, in the 90s for the internet. So that's how it is. All right, so, thank you. you know, and I want to add here, see again, uh, the, uh, keeping with his sort of uh, uh, approach of speaking little always, but I must use this chance to mention. I mean, we know Ajay as 
an actor, as a filmmaker, and, and his passion for the craft uh, is such. I was reading uh, uh, Amit Ji's, uh, you know, one of his uh, interviews uh, on, on Runway 34 itself, and he was talking about, and Amit Ji is a person who's also very, very disciplined. And he was talking about how amazed he was with all the cameras that were set up, and Ajay would go across and do this. And we've seen his passion out of, you know, films like Kanatanaji, which is one of the biggest hits, yeah. but the entire visual effects of that came around. So the one thing that he did say to me was that, Jobi Karo Isko, you know, make it such that it reaches maximum number of people. So that's why Jomne Yapi Kia is simple. The idea is to make it inclusive. And this was, you know, a little bit of a brief that we got. So we are trying to do that. Well, I'm sure uh, you guys are definitely doing a commendable job. And like he also mentioned that you want to reach out to the, to the masses. And this is going to be a great, great platform where you both have collaborated together and, you know, getting involved and taking people to new heights and making them, you know, reach to where they have not, like the metaverse. So uh, a huge round of applause for them. And Jesse Ki. This is going to be a fun-filled ride. So now the time has come. Filhal, like we are mid-air here. And uh, right now, there is something uh, very important and very interesting that we would also like to announce. And I think I'll leave it to you, Ajay, to reveal that particular thing that we are supposed to mention it to them. Why don't you say? Why don't you say? Okay, with your permission. So, uh, you, you saw the experience of the game. I mean, game is one point, you know, which is, uh, yes, you earn points in that, you can take it across, etc. But uh, in today's uh, time, uh, there is an entire set of uh, moviegoers, uh, cinegoers, uh, consumers, who are wanting some kind of, uh, you know, a little more than just experiencing something. And that is where... I'm delighted that uh, with Runway 34, we will also be introducing a set of NFTs. NFTs is essentially non-fungible tokens. We've taken certain parts uh, from the film, the characters of the film, and converted that uh, into very unique uh, NFTs, uh, which will be made available and be brought onto the Heftiverse platform. And we will be dropping those NFTs uh, over the next about eight, nine days uh, for people to both experience as well as get a chance to earn and own as well. Well, that's definitely a great initiative. Like, it'll be more connecting the fans a step closer. And um, I wouldn't take much of your time right now, but rather leave the floor open for the media. So. So people from the media, you can now ask certain questions if you have any. Hello. Hi, uh, Shadma this side from Home Bollywood. Uh, Nira sir, my question is that first of all, congratulations for Metaverse. I would like to know how you know, uh, the Indian market will be so successful in the Indian market. What are your thoughts about this? So, what is the Metaverse will be successful in the Indian market? So, if you look at what we are doing in this way, इसमें गेम गेमिंग तो जो है इंडियन मार्केट में इस वक्त बहुत इट इज़ वन ऑफ द फास्टेस्ट ग्रोइंग मार्केट्स इन द वर्ल्ड टुडे इन इंडिया देर इज़ क्लोजर टू अबाउट 380 मिलियन कंज्यूमर्स हु आर प्लेइंग डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ गेम फ्रॉम बेसिक व्हाट वी कॉल एस कैजुअल मोबाइल गेमिंग टू ईस्पोर्ट्स एट्सेट्रा द now to start connecting with consumers because metaverse mein aap jo bhi banaye wo aaj ke liye nahi hai it is up to you to keep it for whatever period of time that is the reason why the brief of keeping it simple so it's the game but you have an opportunity to share parts of your experience which will remain forever in terms of you know how you're building it out so the metaverse is still early days jaisa maine sabse pehle bola ki metaverse is today where perhaps the internet was in the early 90s. Right. But the pace at which adoption is going to happen, uh, I can safely say to you that, you know, in the next five years, 
there will be closer to 500 million consumers in India, जो कि जिसे कहा कहा जाएगा कि वो Web3 customers हैं, क्योंकि वो shift होगा. Right. Uh, Ajay sir, my question is that, you know, uh, don't you think it's a win-win situation for you because we all know that youngsters, even kids, today, uh, social media, technology, how much they are connected to all these things. So, uh, you know, do you think that running away from this is a win-win situation for you because we all know that youngsters, even kids, today, social media, technology, how much they are connected to all these things. So, do you think running away from this is a win-win situation एक पॉजिटिव एस्पेक्ट होगा क्योंकि अट्रैक्ट करेगी यंगस्टर्स को और ज़्यादा इस फिल्म को कोशिश तो यही है और कहानी रनवे तक खत्म नहीं होती है जैसे कि नीरज बता रहे थे कि दिस इज़ द फ्यूचर जो मुझे भी लगता है दिस इज़ द फ्यूचर तो कोई भी चीज़ जो नई शुरू होती है और जो हमको लगता है कि वो बहुत आगे तक जाएगी और दैट इज़ द फ्यूचर मुझे उसके साथ जुड़ना पसंद है तो आई वॉन्ट टू स्टार्ट दिस अर्ली एंड दैट्स वाई वी डिसाइड टू स्टार्ट दिस आप गेमिंग भी अगर देखेंगे तो गेमिंग को इतना सिंपल रखा है वरना हम कुछ हैवी ड्यूटी भी कर सकते थे लेकिन उसके लिए जो गैजेट्स की ज़रूरत है वो सबके पास है नहीं वो बहुत ही लिमिटेड लोगों के पास है इसलिए गेमिंग भी इतनी सिंपल रखी है कि आप अपने आपके पास जो भी है फ़ोन या जिस पर भी आप आराम से खेल सकते हैं आज आप देखें तो इवन माई सन वो स्कूल से छूटते हैं उसके बाद हेडफोन लगा के ऑल द किड्स आर गेमिंग और पिछले दो ढाई साल में तो इतना ज़्यादा हो गया ड्यूरिंग द पैंडमिक सो दैट इज़ द फ्यूचर एंड यू कॉन्ट चेंज इट थैंक यू सो मच गेमिंग में है और जैसे कि आपने बताया यंगस्टर गेमिंग आई मीन कुछ साल पहले तक तो मैं बहुत गेमिंग करता था गेमिंग करने का वक्त ही नहीं मिलता है हाँ तो गेमिंग गेमिंग मुझे बहुत पसंद थी जैसे कि मैंने कहा कि वक्त नहीं मिलता और दिस इज़ द फ्यूचर और पहले भी बहुत सारी गेमिंग आई हैं बट ये पहली बार ऐसे हो रहा है और इट्स इट्स जो मेटावर्स में जुड़ के कर रहे हैं हम कैरेक्टर के साथ जो आपने देखा वो पहली बार हो रहा है तो जब कोई चीज़ पहली बार होती है तो उसे शायद थोड़ा वक्त लगता है लेकिन वो पकड़ती ज़रूर है बहुत सारी गेम्स आई मीन पहले ये अपना प्ले स्टेशन एक्स बॉक्स ये जितनी गेम है सब हम खेलते थे अभी भी खेलते हैं कभी कभी बट अब बच्चे ज़्यादा खेलते हैं हाय अजय सर माई क्वेश्चन टू यू इज सो आई रिमेंबर ड्यूरिंग द प्रमोशन ऑफ रूद्रा यू आर डन इंटरव्यूज इन मेटावर्स यू आर डूइंग दिस विद रन वे थोड़ी फो Uh, is this something that you're planning to continue with the projects ahead as well? Of course, like we said, this is just the beginning, and like I like like I previously said also, that uh, uh, it, this is the future, and if you are not with the future, you're not there at all. So you'll be left behind. So uh, definitely, we need to. I don't know uh, how much it's going to work today, but in the long run, this is what is going to work, and I wanted to be a part of it. Neeraj, my question to you is: You've associated with Ajay Devgan for Runway 34. Do you have any other associations also in mind? Yeah, we've we've uh, made a couple of announcements uh, in the past, and you'll continue to see more and more uh, partnerships. But today is about Runway 34, and that is the one which we are most excited about. Hi, uh, Neeraj, I have a question for you. Definitely, when we look at uh, metaverse or when we look at augmented reality. it's me here yeah so when we definitely look at uh, metaverse or augmented reality definitely it gives a very lavish and lucrative feel to the audience mm. but are we go, are we somewhere having a competitiveness as compared to the south indian cinemas which has got a content which is getting uh, uh, better day by day and uh, somewhere it's getting ranked up in the entertainment industry as well see uh, i think uh, i think you're mixing two things here but uh, let me respond to you about uh, see today what you spoke about augmented reality so there are three four forms there can be augmented reality augmented reality to aap apne phone se bhi kar sakte hain you will get an experience with it then there is virtual reality which requires a certain kind of eyewear okay and then there is the space called mixed reality which is really blending the worlds of phys you know your physical and virtual world uh, the main thing that any of these does is it makes you experience that same content in a different form it is either more immersive it is either more interactive so ek picture hoti hai 
with whichever region it is coming from it is telling a story right and as storytellers their job is to arouse curiosity amongst cinegoers same way we could pehle the person would go and watch it in a cinema hall okay there used to be one print two prints whatever and that's how it used to work around then you started watching it on television today you watch it on ott so one part of it is a new platform and the second is technology which enables you to become more immersive with that entire thing. that is what we are really trying to do here uh, ajay sir yahan uh, par uh, yahan mr bachchan is also part of this film to hum unko kabhi dekhenge in live wo aap parag se puchiye ya mr bachchan se puchiye बट यूजली बिकॉज ऑफ कोविड वो बाहर निकलना उन्हें ज़्यादा मना भी है तो उन्होंने जितना भी प्रमोशन किया अपने ऑफिस से हमने साथ में जो भी बाइट्स और वो सब किए उन्होंने अपना किया बट आई थिंक ही हैज टू बी इन अ सेफ एनवायरमेंट एट द मोमेंट थैंक यू सर एनी मोर क्वेश्चन Okay, so before we end this, there is a small AV that we would like to show it to you. Since आप सबको हम बता रहे थे कि what is NFT. So with this, you'll get an idea that what are the things that will be available on NFT from Runway 34. So there's a small AV that we would like to show it to you. Pointing to this, what you see here is uh, obviously some of the elements from the film which have been digitized. एक NFT में एक चीज होती है which is a collectible value dusri hoti hai what is the utility inside that as well and uh, the idea will always be to keep on incorporating elements so these are things which as we keep on progressing uh, consumers will get to use this nft for access for getting uh, into other engagements etc so this is a starting process of what has happened and uh, we look forward to everyone's support and thank the entire media for taking the time to do this i also want to thank uh, hari who's uh, had the patience uh, with everything that we worked around and uh, our partners uh, as well uh, both on the edao as well as on polygon thank you so much guys for everything well thank you thank and you meanwhile i mean since ajay is here we would see if you could you know pass on a message to all your fans out there and since the movie is coming out soon is there a quick message that you would like to give it to your fans i think uh, the message is the film and uh, i hope they all watch it and like it and uh, this is a new beginning uh, so the metaverse and i hope they all go on it and play the game thank you so much thank you a huge round of applause for ajay tekan and neera joy everyone thank you Thank you thank you so much and thank you everyone for gracing us with your presence and being a part of this event this is Priyanka Lalwani signing off on behalf of Hangama and Heftiverse thank you so much have a good day ahead thank you